We've seen many positive benefits from our carbon offset program. First and foremost, we've cut emissions by a million, over a million tons. Um, at the same time, we've improved the lives of 800,000 people. Aviva provides insurance, long-term savings and investments. The purpose being to free our customers from the fear of uncertainty. Our carbon offset program is completely aligned to our business goals. Tackling climate change is fundamental to the success of our business going forwards. Climate change may affect are the insurability of some risks um, and from an investor point of view we need to understand the climate risks that our investments face and what we can do to improve and support a low carbon future for our economy going forwards. So our carbon management strategy is, is in three parts really. Um, we do as much as we can internally through initiatives and technologies, behaviour changes to reduce our carbon emissions. Secondly, we purchase as much renewable electricity as possible. Um, but there are still those remaining emissions that we can't do anything else with internally. This is where carbon offsetting plays a vital part in demonstrating our responsibility um, in, in respect to this area. So we were inspired to get involved in carbon offsetting because regardless of how much we can do internally in terms of initiatives uh, to reduce our carbon emissions as a business, we can never totally eliminate them. So we were lucky in 2006 that our board understood the role that we can play in tackling climate change as a business. However, we still had to put together a business case for offsetting. We are a business and therefore we have to be able to demonstrate the business case for whatever we do. Having a set of robust verifiable data behind the carbon projects, both in terms of carbon reductions itself but also in terms of the social impacts, the lives improved. Is, is something that's very important to us um, to be able to demonstrate both internally and externally. The robust data that's part of a carbon offset project helps us demonstrate the value from money to the business but also the positive environmental impacts that the projects have as well as creating a sustainable legacy. We find carbon offsetting to be a very cost-effective way of reducing our carbon emissions whilst providing positive social benefits. In 2010, we set a carbon reduction target of 20% to 2020. By the end of last year, we'd managed to achieve a 32% reduction. So we've now set a new long-term reduction target of 40% to 2020 and 50% to 2030. In 2011, we started working to understand the, um, a little bit more about the, the sustainable development element of the carbon reduction programme. Um, we wanted to be able to measure the lives improved and how those lives were improved. Um, we were comparing our carbon offset programme with our community investments. Uh, and our community investment program used the London benchmarking uh, methodology to measure the social impact of our community investments. I think probably a, another challenge of uh, carbon offsetting was, was actually engaging people. It's very difficult to explain to somebody what a ton of carbon looks like. Um, 
So we always had that challenge. The benefits that we've seen um, through being able to attach uh, and measure the lives improved um, from the projects that we use to reduce our carbon means that anybody that we talk to has a better understanding of the impact that the projects actually create. So we've tried to engage the team and also our wider stakeholders by explaining how the carbon offsetting fits in with our overall carbon management programme. We've been very proud of our offset programme. Um, it's helped engage uh, our employees throughout the business and is able to demonstrate in a practical way how we're tackling climate change um, and the benefits that provides. I believe that carbon offsetting, if it is done properly, can have the dual benefits of reducing our carbon emissions for the company, but also having a positive impact on the communities in which we operate or we have an impact on. It's not just about having long-term sustainable business, it's about being able to build resilient communities on which our companies rely. We're all in this together.